And uh, God, Malachi goes on in this wonderful book, and he wants to say one thing. This Christian life is all about living for the sake of God's name. He says this, From the rising of the sun, even to the going down the same, my name shall be great. My name, God's name, shall be great among all the Gentiles. And he says, You have profaned it. He's talking to the priest and the people. You profane my name. You do not give glory to my name. And he says, How have you done that? You brought that which was torn and lame and sick, and thus you brought as an offering. Should I accept this at your hand? I want to challenge you and me. What are we bringing to God? Are we bringing leftovers, second best, third best? When we realize the name of God, we're going to give him our best. He said, you wouldn't even bring the governor of your land the things that you're bringing me. You know, as I meditate on that, I'm thinking as a Christian, am I giving God my best time? You know, we've been challenging you to get in the Word. Is that, is God getting a priority of your time? Is that a priority or is He getting leftovers? When you go to church and you give that offering, do you pull out what's left? Or do you say, God, you deserve the best. I'm going to give you my first fruits. You know, God is not mocked. He knows our heart. And what God wants to do is be glorified. And His name is above all names. And we are to profess that name, to live that name, and to believe in that name, and to honor that name. So I've just been saying in my life, is God going to get the best this week? What am I going to do? to bring God glory. What am I going to do that's going to honor His name and tremble in fear at His word? So men, as you look at your life this week, are you giving God your best? He deserves it. God bless you.